There is no injustice. We all go through pain and suffering and depressions for reasons. I have experienced my fair share of depression, like I talked about in my last video, but it is all a sign. No one is innocent, and my own suffering is deserved and a direct result of my own actions and sins. So pay very close attention to your own suffering. We ask God how he can allow such evil to happen to us and other people, and nothing ever happened to the evildoer, but there is no injustice in the universe at all. And everything is deserving. Time creates an, the illusion of injustice by delaying the consequences of our deeds, but we get away with absolutely nothing. And space redirects payback into a different area of our life, and so we often fail to connect the dots when supposed random chaos strikes. Time and space are the instruments necessary to fabricate free will. There is a story of a man who once stood before God and his heart breaking from the pain and injustice in the world. Dear God, he cried out, look at all the suffering, the anguish and distress in your world. Why don't you send help? God responded to him, I did send help, I sent you. When we tell our children that story, we must tell them that each one of them was sent to help repair the broken world, and that is not the task of an instant or a year, but of a lifetime. People like to scream at God and like to scream, why does God allow such darkness and starving in the world? I screamed at God for the starving child until I saw the starving child was God screaming back at me.